Hey, I'm Luke, this is Invisible with you again playing Sphinx and the Cursed Mummy. In the last episode, we knew that the jewels in the museum have been stolen, and in this episode, we are going to use the new key item that we got after we donated a monster after we um, bought it for 70 gold scarves. So, let me see here. Um, how do we use that thing that we just got? Let's go right now here first to, to see any zipper lines that we can use. Hmm, like this one. Cool. Now we can travel to any places that, that have zipping lines. Which means as well we can go to that little island. Let's go here. And get some more money and health. Nothing else here, so then let's get it back. Okay. <laughs> okay, now let's see what else we can do here. Go up and use this one over here. Good. Red scab. Okay, what else? Um, I think that we should go up again to the higher floor. Okay, let's get going. Since we have right now the key item, I do believe we have some places here we can visit now. And again, we can give this uh, poor guy two more scarves. What else do we can we do here? Hmm. I do believe we have something here. Okay, good. How nice, more scarves. Anything else here? Hello! Hi, I'm Con... Conso, the boat captain. You seem like the typical guy who loves adventures. My service includes holiday trips and of all kinds, at very reasonable price. If you like, I can Provide transport to Hillibus for nearly 25 scarves. Do we have that? Uh, okay, let's go. Next stop, Hillibus. And lost all our scarves. No worries, we'll get more later. Okay now, so let me see here now what we will be having. Didn't uh, Mhatib told, uh, tell us to come to Hillibus so he can talk to us about uh, some important stuff? Again to the Yurid Castle for some reason. <laughs> and this thing glows and spits out the mummy and Ahnatin and his traitor. Arr, I don't believe it. Defeated by a Jovelin that I don't even know. So they call us Jove Jovenel. The magic, the magical device has returned to the dark castle. <coughs> and now this we can't use his life energy to take his shape. Now he is worthless to us. I'll leave my assistant throw him into the jail to rot with other corpses. The loss of the warping amulets, thanks to our unwanted trip, also caused me to concern this is bitter blue. So the old amulets were actually a teleporting amulets. Without those amulets, it will take longer than 
anticipated to reach our objectives. A, ser a setback, <coughs> this is perhaps, but defeat, the everything is going according to the plan. Master, how can you say that? Now that Tarak Amen has been eliminated, I will use this Akhnatin shape and explain to all that Tut has died in an accident. Wait a minute, he's not even Akhnatin? Then who is he? That will give me power. That will give me power in Luxor. The rest will be easy. Who are you if you're not Akhnatin? If that's true, nobody will dare to say that you are not his brother. Who are you? Oh, hi. Of course not. My disguise is perfect. And you are? Who are you? And about that youngster interrupting the ceremony, I know who he is. He is a student of Amhatab, um, 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 that <coughs> foolish Geronetic magician. This appears the appearance defeated defeat <coughs> will be useful to confuse this feeble mind further. He will never know what is really going on. He doesn't even realize I was there. Master, you are a genius. We need to be careful for now, but when the ray is powerful enough, nothing will stop us defeating Imhotep will be <coughs> as easy as crushing an insect. So then, that wasn't even Akhnatin, the brother of Tut al -Amin. That was another guy who was having a disguise as Akhnatin. So who the hell is he? <coughs> oh. So then, they needed his body to get a disguise, then Akhnatin is already dead. Who the hell is this evil guy? <coughs> and we are here in Hilbus. Let me see how many minutes we have been recording for. Seven. Here we are, Hilbus, at last. This was once a great kingdom, now it's no more than a forsaken desert wasteland. Okay, personally I think you should have stayed in Abydos. You won't find much here other than sand and vicious bonuses. In fact, that's preciously why I'm sailing back to Abydos immediately. I'll be back around those parts in a few days. I might see you then. What a coward. Anyway. Let's head back here and see what do we have here. So. Chris, please. Hello. I've had enough of Helibus. I used to be a great place to live, but then Anubis <coughs> decided to interfere. He cursed my brother, along with everyone else in the cursed palace over there. He made those deadly eyes of Fra posts appear in every corner of the land. He made the soil burn and in infertile. I can't grow anything on the farm. Yes, it's all down to Anubis. I bet he's sitting in his tower looking down on Helbus, laughing at all the misery and suffering. Someone should pay him a visit, teach him a lesson. Hmm. So we have another ancient, uh, uh, ancient Egyptian god, which is Anubis. That's making a lot of problems. We won't be visiting the Crystal Blitz right now. We'll be saving our game over here. And my tongue is getting really tired of all this live commentary. My god. I've been talking for two hours. Sheesh. <coughs> okay, well, let's just continue up our ways and. What's this? What's this? Weird. Anyway, let's just continue up our ways over here and go pay. Wait a minute, what's this? Hmm. Huh. Oh, I'm too. Fine. Okay, let's go pay this 
guy that's called Anubis a visit. Okay? Well, now then. Mm, okay. What the? Horus! There you are. I knew that we would meet again. As you can see, I heroically managed to survive in Uruk. Well, I won't bore you with details. You got lucky in the Uruk, and by rights, that blade should be mine. You would never have found it without my help. Actually, I would have found it with either your, with either your, your help or without it. Yet again, you credit yourself with a greater skill than you possess. You can't get up he on here. You don't have the power to jump high enough. Your weakness is pathetic. I found Imhotep in the temple of the Sunshine Island. That crazy old fool told me he was looking for you. As you can see, you can't even get inside. I will solve the problem with Anubis that Anubis has created by myself, despite what Imhotep says. See you around. He is really cocky. He is nothing but a little moron. Excuse me, excuse me, but don't misunderstand me. I do, uh, I do respect the ancient, the ancient Egyptian gods, but why? Not? Well, whatever. A little, what the? We have a new, a new enemy here, and it looks like an armadillo. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's him to burn this thing. Hey, moron. Ow! I'm the moron. Sorry. You... Ow! Oh, no. No, no, no. Can this shield protect me from this guy? I wonder. What is this? A Gaston. A key item. A charmed stone allows you to summon the great eagle when you stood a special stood. Oh, no. Okay, good. Take this thing. Ow! Take this! Silly thing. And again, no help for me. Those greedy designers. <coughs> Let's go use that thing. But where? I wonder. I'm really getting tired of this live commentary. Seriously. Let's just swim here. Fine, let's go, let's go here. Excuse me. Hmm. I do believe this... Okay, this looks like a bird. Great eagle stone. What do you know? The mummy eagle came, us, came to help us. Can we know we can't control him? Fine. Thank you. Let's go up here first to see what's, what do we have here. Oh my god, my tongue is really getting tired of this. Oh, okay. Good enough. Hmm. I can't catch this. Like, what else do we have here? Another great eagle stone. What else? Okay, what's this? Um, whatever. I can't read these things yet. And that place looks like some weird thing. Let's just use the eagle stone again and see where it will take us to. Okay, so it's going to take us behind the enemy lines. How nice. Okay, whatever. What do I have else here? Attack. Shut up. Okay, two BDS out the warning strong swimmers only. What does he mean by strong swimmers only? Oh, it's locked.
I get up. How are we going to get to that place? Break the sink? Scarabs? How the hell are we supposed to get to that double jump? I mean, that high. We need a double jump. We can't do it without it. Okay, well, we have nothing but the shield of Osiris over here. Oh, wait, what is this? Boom boom again. Okay, come here. Come here, moron. Come here. Let him break this place. Okay, boom boom, come here. Wow. Okay, let's let's continue up. Before that, let me check how long have we been recording for. Sixty minutes. Okay, the next save point we will stop. What's this place? To Crystal Palace and the Great Wall Entrance One. Okay. Hmm. Oh, hi. Ah, uh, hi there. You look like someone who relishes a physical challenge. I am important attribute in these dark and dangerous times. I am the best swimmer in Helibus. I am definitely better than those weak weakings of Adobus. Ab Abidus, sorry. I'm perfect my I have perfected my techniques on training the curse in the sea between South Beach and Sunshine Island. Do you think you can complete my training course? I uh, know. You've probably saved yourself some embarrassment, my friend. Come back if you change your mind. Shamboran, I only said no because he said something about the sunshine, which means I have um, a higher pr opportunity, I mean a higher uh, responsibility to go to talk to an I'm hunted first. What is this place? Break. Uh, an eye? It looks like it would fit into eyes or whatever. Um, hello? Greetings. Welcome to Helibus. Allow me to introduce my, to you to my beautiful wife, Kira. Hi. My husband is worried about Helibus. I can't blame him. It has become a dark, oppressive palace. So instead of, pre of introducing himself to us, he introduced his wife to us. So this is Mrs. Kita. I don't know. Let's uh, explore the, this area a little bit more before we do anything else. I don't know even where the sunshine is. Oh, what's this? To Sunshine Island, beware of the spinefish. So that's the shrine, the sunshine. But first, let's see what is in here. Hmm, okay, whatever. Let's just go right now. Imhatib is waiting for us. Fast. A little faster, please. Thanks. As you can see, how he's uh, swimming. He learned how to swim very well. Okay, so Amhotep told us to go to the sunshine and visit him, right? Oh, save point. Good. Amhotep's welcome you to sunshine island okay first things first let's go to save points so that means only one thing the video is about to end so you know the drill like and favorite if you enjoy subscribe for more videos in the future and i hope to see you in my next <coughs> part of the sphinx and the curse of mommy walk through so then invisible video logging out see you all guys later and good luck